Hello, happy fall. It is so fall, it's not even funny. I visited my friends at Neon Marketplace because I had to get gas and they are quite literally the cheapest gas in the whole entire city. And when I was there, I was like, you know what? I'm really in the mood for my go-to sandwich, which is the Italian. It's, I think it's called the Signature Italian. And I add some like aioli to it. I do the whole shebang. And then I looked and they had fall items. So this was one of their fall items. They also had some coffees and pizzas. I can't really have cheese, so I avoid the pizzas. I can do it without cheese, obviously. But um, I already had gotten a lot of food. So I was like, all right, let's just stick with this. So I got the New England Autumn Cranberry Salad. That's what it says right there. And it has spinach, arugula, grilled chicken, roasted butternut squash, onions, cranberries, pumpkin seeds, and an apple cider vinaigrette. I love apple cider vinaigrette so freaking much. So that's this bad boy right there. They were so busy. It was lunchtime. And then I did get, ooh, I'm dropping all my little shredded lettuce. My Italian right there. And as an FYI, they do have gluten-free bread there as well. And look at their little bakery item. Ta-da! It's like a little pumpkin bread. And I'm so excited to have it. First off, we're gonna go in on this salad. I'm so excited. Apple cider vinaigrettes, like I said, are just my jam. So we will do a little drizzly. Ooh, ooh, okay. There you go. It's so loaded. Little drizzly. Mmm, butternut squash too. Yum. Oh, that apple cider vinaigrette is fire. Looks so pretty, so full of fall items. We'll grab some arugula, we'll grab some chicken, some ooh, butternut. I can't have all of this because otherwise mom's gonna be like, you didn't save any for me. Got some cranberries. That's phenomenal. That chicken is so moist, so tender. The butternut squash is perfectly cooked. It's not actually undercooked, making it hard. I was worried about the onions being in here. I thought they were gonna be like caramelized. I thought that might be weird. They're perfect. I don't know why I underestimated them. You know, why would I ever doubt neon when they've never done me dirty? Big bites. I'm a big fan of sweetness in my salads. So I love the whole raisin action or cranberry action in a salad or apple. This is fantastic. I'm gonna stick that bad boy back in there. On to the next thing. I feel like I should save dessert for last, but I really wanna try it. I did just fill up gas today. Today is. I did just fill up gas from Neon. Today is October 5th, and close to my house was about 3.35, 3.39, sorry. So it went up from yesterday. It increased by like 12 cents from yesterday. I went to Neon. It was $3.13. Heck yeah. And I just downloaded their app, actually. They have an app, hashtag not sponsored, but they do have an app that you can download and earn rewards and like earn free snacks and 10 cents off your gallon and whatever else. So I did download it because I'm like, I'm here enough. Why not go in on that? This sandwich is perfect. They toasted the bread. I asked not to toast the whole sandwich because I don't really like when my meats are toasted. Weird. I just really wanted the bread toasted. And I added some pickles into it. Let's go in. I haven't had an Italian sub in a minute. Oh, this is so good. Mm -mm -mm. They loaded it. They put salt, pepper, oregano. This is absolutely perfect. 
so let's do a really quick little recap. I got home on my trip on Saturday. It's been so freaking cold home. I don't know what to do with myself. I've been wearing sweatshirts and jackets. I think my body's just so used to the warmer weather because even though it wasn't very long that I was in Hawaii, it was a total of eight days-ish. When I came, when I left, it was still kind of warm here, not super warm, but it definitely wasn't like sweatshirt weather. And now that I'm back and it hit me like that, I'm like, ooh, this is my adjustment period right now. This is where it's cold. My body's like, I'm all set with this. Let's just stay inside. Let's watch Hocus Pocus. I haven't watched it yet because obviously it came out when I was gone. So I'm actually going to watch it tonight. I'm very excited. I've heard mixed reviews, but your girl's a big Hocus Pocus, like Disney fan in general. So, and fun fact, I got a call back to be an extra there, but that was when I was in Florida and I couldn't talk about it, but my girl was very sad about it. So this is our pumpkin loaf. It looks so dang moist. There's little swirlies in it that you can see and there's a frosting on top. Let's try this. This is so moist and decadent. The frosting I thought might be like a cream cheese-esque frosting, but it just tastes like a regular frosting. It's not super sweet. There's not a lot of it, so it's not like overpowering. I love fall so dang much. Like of every other female in this world, fall is just my jam. Pumpkins are great. Apple stuff is great. Pumpkin picking, spooky things, Halloween, pumpkin patches. Apple picking, football. I love this season so dang much. I was actually just talking about how if I were to get married, I would probably get married in fall. But the problem is, is that it's almost like too cold right now. Back in the day, I feel like October was like perfect weather. I think Halloween is gonna be so, so cold this year that I'm like, maybe September might not be a bad plan. September might be like the go-to move. We have years to find out, or hopefully not like that many years, but we have some time to figure it out. But I think September might be the power move. I have food stuck in my teeth. We'll do one more bite of this and I'll wrap this up before it's too long. This one's just bomb. Mm, 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 mm. Crumbs. <clears throat> So overall, a win from my book. I would love to try the, uh, I think it was called like the Harvest Pizza or something like that. It was a fall inspired pizza. I would love to be able to try it. I think I would just have to do no cheese on it. Um, I didn't even check to see what kind of cheese, but nevertheless, I would do no cheese on it. And I will try that in maybe another video. Let me know if you actually want to see it. I love trying different items, especially when places come out with a fall menu. Um, I love fall, in, fall inspired cocktails and drinks and foods and salads. That's just kind of where I thrive. It also is just very like tummy friendly for me. Um, har like the harvest salad didn't even have cheese in it because it doesn't really, it doesn't need it. It has the chicken, it has like the, the um, acidity from the vinaigrette. It has some um, sweetness, like very slight sweetness from the butternut squash, sweetness from the cranberries. So you kind of have all these flavors that mix in that you don't necessarily need a dairy-like product to add in there. And it just comes out phenomenal. So overall, it's a win in my book. I love you guys so much. Like, comment, share, subscribe. S-U-B-S-C-R-I-B-E. -E. And we will see you when I need gas again, which will probably be in like three days. Love you guys. Bye.